Hello out there in cryptocurrency land. Welcome back to Real Crypto. Appreciate you joining me today. I want to talk about the next coming of Ethereum. We're all familiar with Ethereum and all that it's all that it's done and really the big side of this choppy action that it's been. A lot of people have actually written Ethereum off and that is a massive, massive mistake. So as we all know, Ethereum right here is number two on coin market cap with a cap of about $35 billion. And we've watched Bitcoin go up basically double over the past month or so to $136 billion today, while Ethereum has really done nothing, just gone sideways and consolidated. We've even seen the rise of Bitcoin Cash come up and even overtake Ethereum for a brief moment in time. We've seen Ripple come up in market cap significantly. Actually, as we're speaking, Monero and Dash are making moves. Litecoin hasn't done too much. IOTA's come back. Um, Neo's even started to, started to catch a little bit of a bid. But the main point here is that the second largest market cap coin, Ethereum, as of right now, is poised at pretty much any time, um, poised to break out. And by any time, this could, could take up to the rest of the year. We have been talking about this symmetrical triangle in Ethereum for, for quite some time. And it's going to it's gonna pop. I mean, I think it's going to pop a little sooner than later. Maybe we see another pullback. And that would actually be a very healthy, very healthy if it were to pull back again. But I just want to walk you guys through this chart. And I want I want you to see how Ethereum looks right here. And I want you to see what it looked like back here before it made this other extraordinary move. So let's kind of zoom in here. All right. So here we have Ethereum after a massive move. We ran from $10 to $56. $10 to $56, and then it started to put in this little pennant formation here. Does this look familiar to you? Looks familiar to me. Okay, so I'm going to scroll out here. So you notice it puts in this pennant formation after this large uptrend. This is about, you know, if we just call the breakout right here, about a 400% uptrend. A 400% uptrend in Ethereum when we come into this symmetrical triangle pattern. And then, boom, it has a massive run a massive run and this run takes us up an additional 650 percent in ethereum so we take a 400 percent run and turn it into a 650 percent run so i don't know what we're going to do here i don't know if we go up 600 percent here from 370 i'm not sure if we get up to 1800 in ethereum i don't know if that's in the cards but if we were to go up 600 percent from a 35 35 million dollar market cap 35 times six would put us at 210 billion dollars so not quite sure that we're going to do that but i think you're at least do a good hundred percent in ethereum it at least a good hundred percent in ethereum and with this being such a large market cap coin um, i feel very strongly that you could put money to work in ethereum and you have a very high probability of success and you your risk isn't going to be that much so if you're expecting a 100 percent increase if you're to buy once this crosses this trend line here, your downside, you could give it 8% here down to 340. And I think that would be very, very reasonable. So you have a 100% upside to an 8% downside risk. I think that is an extraordinarily good risk reward ratio. Something else I want to point out here is that during this entire consolidation volume, you know, has peaked at the bottoms. But if you take these extremes out, the volume has been pretty light. Um, only a few spikes to the upside until here recently, until the cancellation of the Bitcoin fork. And it's just, um, Ethereum has just slowly marched upwards. But look at the volume increasing. Volume is increasing greatly. And then right here on the right side, as, as we get more towards the right side of the chart, the volume starts to decline. Okay, so we have some, some interesting volume action here. Let's kind of zoom in. We have some interesting volume action happening right here, kind of in this bottoming area. See volume increases right here and doesn't decrease and on that on that note it is making higher lows continuously until we pop up put in another little base notice volume is low on the base that so we pop up again um, and then now we're putting in another little base so but all this is happening while it's pushing right up against this trend line that's very very bullish for ethereum okay so you're going to have a little bit of resistance as we break over this trend line again we could dip back down here you're going to have a little resistance here just before 400 i'm not anticipating much and then up here towards 410 420 area depending on the exchange you're on that's going to give you a little more resistance but 
after that, ladies and gentlemen, it is clear sailing for Ethereum. And this is these are types of patterns, um, just as we saw during this last demonstration. You know, in Ethereum, this looks like we're really high, right? We've had a 400% upward movement, and it looks like we're really high. You know, no one thinks it's going to go up, but then boom, it does. Um, and then people are, are stuck playing catch up. I have a feeling something very similar is going to happen in Ethereum. And what you're going to notice is this chart is going to one day look like this. One day this chart's going to look like this, where this space is negligible and this space seems extraordinarily obvious. This seems extraordinarily obvious and, and we're somewhere up here, double, maybe a little bit more in Ethereum. So um, I feel very strongly about this trade as far as the time frame for it. It's sometime between now and the end of the year. I'm giving you fair warning in advance fair warning in advance and i've actually mentioned this several times if you've been if you've been subscribing to the channel but ethereum is due a huge move we're already seeing moves into all-time highs in some of the smaller coins so dash is here in all-time highs monero just poked into all-time highs and we're sitting up here at 170 we recently broke this high so this is going to the upside uh as we all know bitcoin has just been rocketing into all-time highs making a parabolic move of some kind i think we're going to go higher probably pop into ten thousand at some point in time i have a video about that although the bitcoin fork kind of negated that and gave us our washout early but we're seeing all of these top tier coins or many of these i shouldn't say all of them many of these top tier coins push into all-time highs bitcoin cash has done that in a, in a drastic fashion uh, litecoin not really doing so but it is pushing upwards we should see all-time highs in litecoin fairly soon um, IOTA not IOTA kind of pushing in that direction, but we're not quite there yet. So a lot of these larger cap coins are finally moving, and Ethereum is just sitting there taking its time. Okay, there's people accumulating positions or letting all the sellers get out. If you notice, we don't have these big red sell waves, and the sell waves have diminished in frequency and amplitude. And so if we have another another little sell off to the downside, I would expect it to be smaller than this one. Okay, so, you know, if we take that, maybe cut it in half, um, you know, the, the, the 340 level looks good. If you want to give it more room, give it down to 320, something like that. But in time, this is going to move up and higher. And um, I think it is due its own video, which is why I'm doing it. A lot of people have kind of written off Ethereum because it hasn't been jumpy. It's been flat. You think of it as a boring coin, but one day it's going to wake up and you're going to look back and you're going to go, Oh my God, real crypto was right. Real crypto was right. This thing just had an explosive move up 50, 60, 100% over the course of a couple of weeks, maybe a month or so. It's hard to tell exactly, but you can't lose eyes on these coins making these big patterns. Out of these big patterns come really big moves. You can kind of utilize this, this lower base here as an example. So I just wanted to point that out to everyone. Put that out there. Put this on your watch list. Set an alert over here over these recent highs at 375 um, just so you can be aware of this I will try to you know keep this shouting out as as it happens but you know we can't all be here during the times that these move so all right there you go there's my video on Ethereum tell me what you think in the comments below I'd love to wrap with you guys check out the slack chat if you haven't already you can get the invitation by going to my website real-crypto.com and fo follow me on Twitter at real crypto trade on Twitter, Real Crypto Trade. So thanks guys, subscribe if you like the videos and I will see you in the chat room.